Uh, in our mission statement, we have one line, which is we will have fun and make money, which really talks about the fact that having fun in our business sense doesn't mean we play and party all of the time. It means that we um, are proud to work with our colleagues. We measure it by saying, I get to come to work on Monday, not I have to come to work on Monday. And to create an, that attitude within the company is very important. One of the things that that does for us is we become a community of people who care about each other and we take care of each other, but the ETC family also extends outside of the company. It's to our customers, to our distributors. It's all part of the vision and the focus of the company. And if we stay in the family picture now with Hein System, did you adopt a child now? Oh, let's just say we have a bunch of cousins down in Texas now. <laughs> We're, uh, they are great people. And this is one of the things that we found when we looked at adding them to the ETC family, that it is a natural fit. And it's interesting, in America, there's competition between cities. You have this with your football teams all over Europe. And the University of Texas and the University of Wisconsin have some competition, so, and culturally, but it's a really friendly, healthy thing. When we go down to um, work with them in Texas, we learn about really good barbecue. When they come and work with us in Wisconsin, where we're known for our cheese, they learn about cheese and bratwurst. Could you give us a short glimpse into the future, what the next steps for ETC and Hein Systems will be? Well, that's a good question. If you asked me 40 years ago what ETC would be in 40 years, I couldn't have possibly dreamed this. On a few year version vision, we have a plan, but it will probably change by the time we get to it. We're going to see, the, one of the reasons we also, really from a business aspect, we looked at what ETC could do to add more value and bring something to the industry, to our customers. And we want to get, we had identified that we wanted to get more involved in the concert and event market. We wanted to get more involved in automated lighting and into media control. And when we looked at high end, that was a key that fit perfectly into that lock we had, we had described. They have the whole hog console, a really dramatic and potent line of LED-based automated lighting, and the Axon Media Server and digital lighting background they have. So I believe in the next few years, we're going to keep the markets separate, but we're going to see some more crossing between the technologies. The EOS console has its DNA in the theater. The HOG consoles have their DNA in rock and roll and automation, automated lighting. Um, so we're going to overlap those, but n not ruin each platform. So we will have a good, strong product line to offer to the event market as well as our traditional markets.